Hi, my name is Emily. Hi, my name is Riley. How are you today? Um, I'm doing well. Oh, that's cool. Um, so your name's Riley. It's a really pretty name. How did you get your name? <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, I actually got my name um, from my older sister, who was only four years old at the time I was born. Um, my mom originally wanted to name me Evan, but my dad wasn't feeling that name at all because he wanted his little girl to have a girly name. And um, so they let my sister take a shot at it, and she found the name Riley in a 90s cartoon. <laughs> what was a 90s cartoon? It was um, a Godzilla cartoon, and the name Riley came from a doctor on the show named Dr. Riley. Oh, that's pretty cool that your oldest sister was able to do that for you. Why did your mom want to call you Evan at first? Um, I don't know. I think that she had been looking at boys' names and got a little bit attached to the name <laughs> Evan and then realized yeah. that maybe it wasn't quite the right name. Um, I can see where she was coming from. So your oldest sister, what's her name? My sister's name is Taylor. Oh, okay. Um, how did she get her name? Uh, you know what? Nobody's actually ever told me before. <laughs> so what's family to you? Um, my mom and my sister. So, yeah, I, I, my family unit kind of broke apart when my parents got divorced. So I just have my mom and my sister. Okay. Well, how's your relationship with your sister? Um, it's really good. Um, we hang out all the time. We spend a lot of time at home together. Um, we only don't see each other so because she goes to school in the city, but... Oh, okay. Um, so, what's the age difference? Because I know that can affect relationships depending on a big age gap or a smaller age gap. Yeah, um, she, she's 23 and I'm 19, so she's four years older than me. Oh, okay, so that's a pretty good um, age gap there. Um, so, how was it growing up with you and your sister? Um, it was good. You know, there were times when we were a little bit more separate when we were younger because when... I was four and she was eight in those types of ages. She thought <laughs> she was cooler than me. But um, as we got older, we started to have a lot of the same friends and we started to get along a lot better and spend more time together. It's so really nice to hear. So um, you said you're 19. So when were you born? I was born in 1998. My birthday is December 10th. Okay, cool. So you're a winter baby. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you think about your name? Do you think it matches your personality? Um, I think so. I've been told that I look like a Riley and that people can't really imagine what else I look like. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I, I mean, I think it's it's pretty good. Can you describe your personality? Um, I don't know. Um, sometimes I'm I'm a little bit more reserved and other times I'm super bubbly and talkative and so so it kind of depends like who I'm talking with like which side of me you'll get that's understandable do you like your name being Riley or do you wish your mom I would have named you like Evan <laughs> <laughs> well you know I think either way I probably would have learned to deal with it. Maybe it would have been kind of edgy to be named Evan. <laughs> <laughs> Riley, I think, is, is not really a common name, so I think that it's really unique and um, very different to hear. I, I like the name Riley. Um, have you had any good or bad experiences with the name? Like, has anybody said anything about your name that you didn't like or anything like that? You know, luckily, no, because I know a lot of times, like, kids get bullied for their names mm -hmm. and stuff like that, and... I've gotten um, pretty lucky <laughs> because um, I just haven't, I, I didn't actually end up having too many problems with like bullying or anything mm -hmm. growing up. I actually kind of kept to myself, so okay. <laughs> I was always very um, shy as a kid. That's always a good thing to hear because sometimes a uh, name can cause a lot of judgment. It's kind of like the, per the first um, um, impression you get sometimes from people. Okay, Riley, so getting back to your family, what's your mom's name? My mom's name is Antonella. Her um, her maiden name is Jadoda, so her full name is Antonella Jadoda, but she goes by Anta. Okay, um, so where did she get her name from? Um, she was named by her mother. Her and her um, sisters, she has four of them, they all have like the same kind of Mediterranean, like Italian, Albanian, um, Russian type names. Okay, so where exactly is she from? 
she's from, well, she's Albanian, but she's from, um, she was born in Kosovo, um, but she ended up moving from Kosovo to Italy when she was young, and then um, since she was about eight years old, she's been in the United States. Okay, so what's her ethnicity? She's just 100% Albanian. Okay, and is that the same for you and your sister, or you guys have different ethnicities? Um, so my sister and I are both Albanian, um, 50%, and then my dad is a little bit British, but mostly Lithuanian, so my sister and I to simplify things, we just call ourselves Albanian and Lithuanian. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's really cool. I've never met anybody there from there before, so that's really interesting to hear about. Um, so you mentioned that your mom has a couple of sisters. How many sisters does she have? Um, so she has, let's see, she has four sisters and two brothers. So she has she has a lot of siblings, and then with my sister and I, it's just us two. So. Okay. So did she tell you how growing up with so many siblings was like? Yeah, it was pretty crazy because um, growing up since she um, immigrated to America as well, she ended up living with a lot of her cousins and a lot of her other family members. So she always had a packed house, and I think um, she loves that now she lives in a house with just me and my, and my sister oh. because it's it's much more simple. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's probably much more easier just the calmness from dealing with a lot of siblings because that's a lot of personalities in one household. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> um, so you mentioned that um, she moved to the United States. Um, how old was she or how long has she been living in the United States? Um, she was about eight. So she's been here for um, like about 40 years. Okay. So so she's she's been here for a long time. Okay, so um, what's her first uh, native language? Uh, she grew up um, speaking Albanian, and then um, she started to speak English only when she got into the American school system. Okay, so um, English is her second language. Yeah. So is English your first language or your second? It's my first language. I okay. actually only speak English. <laughs> and is it the same for your sister? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, do you have any interest in learning about um, your other language? Absolutely, yeah. I always just say that um, it, it's terrible that nobody taught me Albanian when I was <laughs> younger because now I'm too old to soak it all up. Yeah. But it, it was really nice meeting with you, and I'm so grateful that you talked with me today. Mm, um, thank you for I, feeling comfortable talking to me. Of course. I am. I have to head to class, but I'm really looking forward to seeing you. Likewise. Um, before you go, do you have any nicknames or any other names that you would like me to call you by other than Riley? Um, you know, some people call me Rye or Riles or other <laughs> silly stuff, but I'm totally fine with Riley. Okay, well, thank you so much. It was great meeting you. Thank you. Nice meeting you, too.